Hi there, I'm Francois Marie Arouet. However, most people know me as Voltaire. I was born in the year 1694, and I'm quite famous for my works as a philosopher and human rights advocate. Much of my works helped inspire the American and French revolutionaries. As a philosopher, I was well known for mocking corrupt royal authorities and politicians, which occasionally did get me into trouble. Multiple times throughout my life, I was imprisoned for speaking against the authorities. Around halfway through my life, I became quite the celebrity due to my activism. People were coming from all over to discuss my works, and my message was spreading like wildfire, slowly helping to shape the world we know today. Tune into CBC 43 for more. Hey there. Today I'm joined by one of the most fascinating people on the planet, Mr. Voltaire. Uh-huh. Mr. Voltaire, what is your legacy? And if you had to sum up your life in one word, what would that word be? Well, I think I can sum it up in two. And that would be smart and preposterous. And if you put those words together, you get smaposterous. My legacy is that I greatly influenced the way people view their leaders and helped create a more fair society. What is your opinion on the rights of civilians? Well, I think everybody should have the right to say whatever they want, even if no one agrees with them. We shouldn't be censoring speech that we don't agree with. Thoughtful debate is the best way to come to a conclusion. Oh yeah, that's right. I saw you on CNN last month. I do not agree with the word you say, but I will defend to death your right to say it. Oh yeah, I remember saying that. What do you believe the best type of ruler is? I think the best type of ruler is more of a enlightened monarch who is well studied and knows what is best for his people. I believe the ruler's job is to protect the rights of the people. So you think an absolute monarchy is good for society? Almost always. However, if the monarch is getting in the way of the people's rights, I believe the people should stand up for themselves. Well, thank you for doing this interview, Mr. Voltaire. No problem. I'm going to mock a corrupt politician now.